In our modern era, maintaining a system that is dependable and stable is paramount for smooth and uninterrupted usage. Whether you're conducting business, enjoying your favorite games, or simply browsing the internet, the last thing you want is to be interrupted by issues stemming from faulty memory in your computer system. Therefore, it is essential to prioritize the health and reliability of your system's memory, ensuring a seamless experience without any disruptions or setbacks. Having faulty RAM is undeniably one of the most exasperating computer issues due to its elusive and unpredictable symptoms. However, you can rely on MemTest 86. MemTest 86 has a history spanning over two decades. It was originally created in 1994 as MemTest 86 and later evolved into MemTest 86 Plus in 2002. Since then, it has become a trusted and widely used memory testing tool for both industrial and consumer use. The project continues to receive updates and contributions from the community, solidifying its reputation as a reliable tool for diagnosing memory-related issues. Are you ready to dive deep into the world of MemTest 86? Watch as we demonstrate the step-by-step -step process of using MemTest 86 to test and diagnose faulty RAM modules, ensuring optimal performance and stability for your computer. First we need to download the software, so we visit the official MemTest 86 Plus website, Click on Download. Now find the file you downloaded and extract it. There are various tools available for creating bootable USB drives, and one popular choice is Rufus. Go ahead and create the bootable drive. Now that the bootable USB drive is ready, restart your computer and boot from USB. Once the countdown completes, the software will automatically initiate the memory testing process. For the purposes of this video we will interrupt the countdown by clicking on the configuration icon. We land on a menu with multiple options. Each one can be accessed by pressing the letter inside the brackets. Test selection. As the title implies, we have the option to choose which tests we want to execute. Address range. We have the flexibility to adjust the range of addresses to be tested. However, it is generally recommended to test all addresses in order to thoroughly check the memory of any computer. CPU selection. In this section, we can specify the number of CPUs that will be utilized for the test. RAM benchmark. We can run a speed test here. Last but not least is the settings menu where we can set up various memtest settings. Without any further delay, we can initiate the memory test by pressing the appropriate key. 
We will speed up the process for demonstration purposes. Now, all we can do is wait for the test to finish. If the test is completed with a pass result then you know that your system memory is ok. Otherwise, you will get a screen like this. This means that your memory module is faulty and you need to replace it. Now, you can confidently reboot your system and resume your work, knowing that your system memory is functioning optimally and meeting expectations. This concludes our demonstration of Memtest 86+. If you found this content informative and valuable, we kindly ask you to show your support by giving us a thumbs up and subscribing to our channel. We appreciate your feedback and suggestions, so please let us know in the comments below if there's any specific topic you would like to learn more about. Your input helps us create more educational content tailored to your interests. Thank you for watching.